Hey, good morning. Good morning. Good news, we have some new Sure conferencing equipment. Bad news, we got a conference call in three minutes. <laughs> Let's get started. <laughs> Thank you. All right, don't worry. This is going to be easy. We're going to use the Sure P300 Intellimix audio conferencing processor. So setup and configuration is simple. We've got two of the MXA310 tabletop array microphones. That's what's going to give us our coverage around the table. Now while Kyle's plugging everything in here, let me tell you about the back panel of the P300. We've got two analog inputs, two analog outputs, one TRRS connection to get your cell phone in, and a USB port which we're going to touch on in a little bit. Now what's nice about all of these devices is they use standard networking protocols with the MXA310s on PoE and the P300 on PoE+. Now everything we see here is a Dante enabled device, so we are plugged into a gigabit switch. If you need more details on the Dante protocol, check out Audinate.com. Once we have everything plugged in, I can open up Web Device Discovery, and then I can find the P300 in there and open it up in a web browser, making it agnostic to any operating system you may be using. Now what's really nice is the first step once you get into P300 is to recall the template for the MXA310 microphone. This is going to optimize the performance of the P300 for this specific Shure mic and make the rest of your programming much more simple. We've also got templates for the MXA910 ceiling array and all of the Microflex wireless microphone options. So once I've recalled the preset in the P300, I can now go back to Web Device Discovery and open up the control panel for the MXA310 microphone. In here, I can recall a preset based on my room. I'll go ahead and recall a three cardioid pattern. And I can move the lobes to fit the table. That's what's so great about the MXA310. You can completely adjust the position and the polar pattern of any of the microphones you deploy. Once we get the coverage set for our room, we're going to jump into the Dante controller software to route our audio from each of the MXA310s to the P300. Now the P300 has eight channels of acoustic echo cancellation, which is perfect for what we're doing today. Now that all of our audio paths have been routed, we're going to get back into the P300 for one last step. The P300 uses a fixed architecture design. It brings in the audio here on the left over Dante, runs straight through a parametric EQ, an acoustic echo canceller, noise reduction filter, auto gain control, and then through the auto mixer. From there, it runs through a simple matrix mixer and out the USB output on the back. Hey guys, we're almost ready in here. Now the last step is to take your USB cable, plug it into the back of the P300, and then into whatever machine you're using to run your web conferencing software. Once you're inside that software, just select the P300 as your external USB microphone and you're set to make a call. Guys, I think we're ready. Let's get in it. All right, how are we looking? We're looking good. Great. I appreciate you guys putting this together so quickly. That was terribly short notice. All right, we live. Here we go. Good morning. Thank you for the opportunity to discuss uh, conferencing solutions from Shure, uh, primarily P300 and MXA microphones. We think that these technologies.